Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we're here today doing the Alpha 10 series. Um, well, Alpha 10.5. So, we just picked out the garden, and it's dark out, and it's late. We should actually go to sleep. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to queue up this to make a bunch of emergency rations. So, you can't make that many, but that's fine. And then we're going to go to sleep. Okay, so now, and the garden is halfway grown again. Excellent. And it's barely, it's still, well, it made a couple. We've got lots of hamburgers made. And we've got a ton of emergency rations, realistically, now. Because we've got, what, 12 on us? And another four. we got... We'll have about a full stack of emergency rations here by the end of this episode, so excellent. Um, today we're going to keep working on the CV, on the cargo, the medium cargo CV. So I think we should put some landing gear on it because it'll probably put a, a cockpit in it, so... And, oh, let's see, when are we getting, oh, we're getting back soon. That's fine. That's fine. We can jump back into our, uh, I guess, you know what, I could just fly that right over. We can just jump into it then. So let's just move that right over beside the CV. Although I did want to put the ramps on. Uh, I'm sure we'll get attacked before we're going to put the ramps on. So let's, we'll just, um, you notice that my shield is, is bugging out, right? So don't have your shields turned on and your engines turned on at the same time if you're docked. Because it'll, it'll just drain your, your fuel. It'll just drain your fuel. It's like it's constantly trying to recharge the... It's constantly trying to recharge the uh, shield, so it, it just and it can't do it while it's docked. So it just it just it's a complete battery sink. Uh, it's a bug. Uh, I have reported it. So um, yeah, I it's it's bad. <laughs> it's bad. Don't do it. Turn the shields off before you dock to a base, to a CV, whatever. Okay, so let's continue on, and as soon as we get our notification that we're being attacked, we'll go deal with that. So we can put, we should be able to put um, the the boxes back in. So let's get all hooked up again here. So we're going to get hooked up to the base, and then blocks. We'll connect to that, and oh, we some silicone for some bizarro reason no idea how I picked that up <laughs> okay um, so we want those two because we can finish that off we also want we're gonna want regular windows we need to make more medical devices uh, we'll put an O2 station in, but in the meantime, we will do the medical device. We're going to need advanced constructor. I don't think we're going to need two. We'll just need the one. We'll put in a fridge, a couple fridges, the food processor, lights. I did put in a bunch of oxygen, right? Yeah. <laughs> like, why, why do I have so much left? Uh, okay. Armor locker. Okay, that's good for now. Let's start putting this stuff in. So, here, let's go right here. So it is easier to play stuff by hand, because you don't jitter, you don't move around. Your avatar stops when you stop your mouse. <clears throat> but... It's slower. 
because you can whip around with your your um, drone much faster okay so basically what we want to do is we want to seal this in with windows so I think I want to do it on the outside though because I want these blocks available and since it's too high here um, that's perfect it won't obstruct with anything that I want to put a, uh, along there so oh you know what we should do let's you know let's um, can we if we look at that can we yeah we can get the base nice <laughs> we need to make a let's say did I make one already I don't think so there's a pistol uh, let's take a look did I ever make an actual, what do we got here? Uh, output, anything? No. Uh, weapons tools, do we have one? Nope. Okay, I didn't make one. So I haven't made... A color tool yet so let's do that that's tools and color texture tool right here so we'll just make one of those real quick okay let's grab that and we can't do it from that toolbar we're going to do it from this one <clears throat> so what we want we're just going to give it a, a primer coat for starters um, just so it doesn't look so bad when we're put it's yeah let's start with let's start with along this back wall let's see what it can do I think we want to make it something simple like this or like that maybe We could do walls like that. Okay, and then what's the color going to be? Do we want the whole block? I don't think we want the whole block. And do we want it white? Or black? Green? What are we going to want in here? Um, probably an off-white gray. Let's see what it looks like. Uh, what about a little bit darker? Just, huh? I don't know, maybe not the gray. Ooh, that really, that really snaps. I really like the navy, kind of the the navy green look to it. I, I do like that. Oops. And I guess I could do all the walls that. And then we'll come up with a texture for the floor and ceiling. So let's do that. Get that. We'll have to jump up there. So should I do that up there too then? Yep. Unfortunately, the the cargo controllers uh, you, you have to paint the entire thing just like the elevator blocks. That's not a big deal, though. Okay. I mean, I don't mind that look for the hanger. It's hangerish looking.
Oh, it's cool that it uh, that it's the same texture palette for both the extensions and the hardened steel block. That way, I don't have to like jump back and forth. Now let's just paint these. Oops. You can see it rotated. Gotta get that one. There we go. Okay. Um, okay, so now that we've got the walls here, I just wanted to get this in here so we can start putting equipment in and the uh, windows. So what else are we going to put on the ground here? We're going to do, um, I don't know, let's, let's think about the ground in a second. Let's finish putting the windows in now. So... Should I continue? I don't know. We'll, we'll think of the floor up here in a second. Let's do the windows. And, oh, I got them already. Right. Derp a derp. So what do we got here? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Okay, we're going to do two by twos. And we're going to do the outside one right there. Like that. And then so this is going to be tough. Oh, no. There we go. And then this might be easier up against the elevator. Like that. Um, not really sure how I'm going to seal the elevator to tell you the truth. Now I look at it, it's like, uh, I don't think I can seal the elevator like that. Not that it has to be. This is more for just show, really. So it, this doesn't even have to be sealed. It can just share its air with the uh, hanger. <laughs> come on. I know you. Come on. Oh. Oh, I had you. Come on. Can I, Oh, right there. Okay. Yeah. That gives us a nice chunk of space to work with here, up here. Um, I mean, I guess what I could do is I can just, to seal it, I can put, you know, let's do a small window and we'll just rotate it. We'll do that. And then we can do a door there. Or a little force field. Uh, what should we do? Door or force field? Do we have any force fields? I think I used them all, didn't I? Pretty sure I did. Nope. Okay. Although, if I put a force field in here, that's going to do the arrest room thing. So let's not. Let's just do a door. We're just going to do a door. Just a door. Where are you? Right here. Yeah, I gotta keep thinking about the uh, higher level gear and mats. I wanna make sure this thing doesn't really. Oops, come on. Right there. Okay, so now it is sealed in here. Um, with its own air. Okay, there we go. So that's built. Let's put the lights in. So that'll go 
there, 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 and there. Yep. Okay. Um, and the great thing is because the windows are on the outside, these blocks aren't actually being used here. I can actually use these blocks to put the um, stuff like the wind, uh, not window, the fridges. So do I want one on either side or do I want... Both of these on one side, and then the, yeah, this, like, that, or even over here, because I can do medical stuff or something along there. Yeah, so let's go like this, and then we'll do the medical stuff. Although the, I think this I want, um, beside this. Whoop. Yeah, so we'll go like this. That way we can put the other stuff in a, in the shorter um, space. Okay, so we want to rotate this one like that. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Um, oh, we didn't we didn't figure out on the the floor. Uh, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal. What should I, I actually for for this? It's going to be completely different than everything else. So let's let's do that really quick here. We can we can texture that up really quick. So I think what I want is like a standard floor, like either like that or like that. Um, no, that looks more for a wall. I'm trying to look at, see what's good for a floor. I like that too. I do like that. Okay, this is it. <laughs> this is what we're doing. I can paint. I can repaint later all the uh, equipment. I don't care if it's going to be all green right now. It doesn't really matter. I just want to Okay, we'll just get the hanger painted here. I mean, I could do a bigger area paint job, but then I'll get other things, so it's don't really need to. Small enough area. Okay. Nice. That actually will look really cool when the lights get turned on. It's a nice big area in here. I like it. Okay. Um, so let's start putting in... I want to put the constructor over here. It's because the stupid constructors, how they how they make them. 
So the model for these things, so that the panel has panels on two sides. On the front, there's there's a panel side right here, and then there's a panel side. So if you want to get to both, right? I could either do it so that it's like that and have no panel at all. Although, is that a panel right there? I don't think it is. I don't remember. Do I, you know what? Let's place it and see. What, yeah, it's not a panel. See, it's the back of it. That's lame. Okay, so let's let's lift that. <laughs> okay. Um, So let's go back to spit. Nope, that's not it. Come on, four. Thank you. I think we're going to place it like this. Just because it has, we can have access to both there. We can have a space there. Okay. Um, not really sure what I'm going to do down on the other end. I think I'm going to put regular cargo boxes down here. Yeah, let's do a bunch of regular cargo. So we're going to do the 16K. We've got the newer, the new ones with the yellow trim. Yeah, they look new. We'll keep using them until the novelty wears out. So we'll do... Let's do six of those over here. Constructor there. Some more cargo there, even though that, that whole wall and up top there is all cargo. That entire wall is cargo. Um, Okay, so now, what other equipment are we going to put in here? Down here, we can do, we can do armor locker. Yeah, I mean, we don't need... I don't need a ton of stuff down here, do I? I mean, that's armor locker, O2. We've got some healing. Okay. Some space to shove the nose of the vehicles up against the wall. If we need to. Okay, let's go up here. And I guess we should think about the cockpit, too. So let's grab that. Let's grab that. Where are you? I know I... There it is. Okay, we don't need any more fridges. Probably no more cargo boxes. Don't think any more windows or doors or lights. We might do another armor locker up there, another O2, maybe. I don't know where to put them unless they're up along here. So, I guess we're going to have living quarters up in the cat, up in the cockpit. That kind of sucks. I didn't really think about that, did I? Uh, well, maybe we'll put a bed down there. Yeah. In the garden. We'll live in the garden. We can do that. Okay, so let's put this. It's got to go way the heck up here. Uh, you know what? We need a full panel job here. Yeah, that one. Okay. Now, I'm not going to jump in or else this thing will drop to the ground because it's got no landing gear. So let's... That's all ready to go there. We also... Oh, 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 oh. We need, where's our switches? There we go. Sensors and switches. So I want to put a regular switch in the ceiling right here. So just a switch right there. And then we want sensors. 
up up there so we want sensors one there and which that was that one there okay and right there okay so we don't have ramps built so what kind of ramp should it see? It's foggy again. Do I have to clear the weather all the freaking time on this planet? How annoying. How freaking annoying. Eh? It's never good weather. It's always freaking raining and foggy, it seems. Uh, um, I don't know why I'm walking all the way over here. I could just... But you know what? I do like walking up to the constructors and, and making stuff. So let's make some ramps. TVBA. Okay, did we not make any stairs? No, I don't see any ramps. No, we've got that's a base one. That's fine. I don't want to put any uh, high level stuff in, in here yet, anyway. Oh, there we go. Here we are. We under attack. Yay! Sort of yay. And of course we're way over <laughs> parked completely the furthest away because you know at the time we thought we would be closer. Of course. It's okay. That's okay. Whereabouts are they coming from this time? So they came from this direction last time. Oh, almost the same direction. So let's, wow. Okay, they're ramping it up now. Holy crap, buddy. Oh, crap. And she lived. Did it hit my my new ride at all? No? Okay, we can repair that. <laughs> okay, well, they, uh, that's interesting. That was, that was, what, four? drones that time okay okay well let's land and repair Took some good damage there because I was feeving out. Ow, I keep doing that. Hurt myself. <laughs> I jumped too high off my ship to hurt myself. Yeah, look at that. Whew. Oh, not too bad. Yeah, they didn't go after the little ones at all. No. And, oh yeah, the turret got hit hard. Took over a thousand damage. What? Nothing that some quick repairs can't solve. Well, it's cool that they actually hit me. Not that they actually did anything. So that means I guess I should, like, see, they used to be always attacking from the back. Now they're starting to always attack from over here in more frequency and force. So now, what does it say? Nothing. So it's not calculated again yet. That's fine. 
That's fine. Let's um, continue building. We'll continue building. So we need some landing gear. Did I make any landing gear? Did I make any landing gear? No. Okay, we've got four sentry guns. We're going to need more than that. Got a bunch of, oops, what am I doing? What am I doing? Let's reconnect. Four sentry guns. Lights. We could use the LCD screens, but I can put those in later. Okay. Okay, I think that's... You know what? We'll, we're going to be putting in a bunch of lights. And why do I have a bunch of parts? That's fine. <clears throat> Oops. That's not a part. That's a part. And that's a part. Okay. Okay. So let's get this stuff in. But first we've got to get this making the ramps. So let's, um, let's get one made and then we can see what we need we might need a whole bunch and we also need CV, SV, CV. We're going to do four of these. Okay, so let's take a look at um, where'd it go? There it is. Let's take a look at the ramp sizes here and see what we what we're gonna need I want it to come down to and actually touch the floor to be like a, an actual cargo you know loader so that so that heavy loaded things can actually make it up the ramp into the it doesn't seem realistic like a, a cargo thing is gonna have to jump up to get into a cargo ship you know so what do we got? That's too deep. Too deep. Right there. Um, one wide. Three wide. That's three deep. So it's three wide. Uh, that's it for the two deep and one. One wide. Three wide. Okay, well, between that, you can do pretty much everything, then, right? So, let's do the three wide. We'll flip that. And then, so that's going to... Come on. Oh, it doesn't want to go down if I... If I go down? Yeah. So how far, oh, uh, if I move it though. So do I want all these blocks? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do I want all of them to come out as a ramp? Or do I just want like the three at the very front? I'm thinking the three at the, three at the front is good enough, right? Yeah, it doesn't have to be super wide. Three three wide should be sufficient. Okay, so let's drop that, and we'll get that installed right there. And we'll go put the other, we'll build one more. Put it on the other side here. Okay.
Okay, get this ramp built. Excellent. And it's built our stuff. So let's grab that. And the ramp. Get the ramp in. So again, we're going to do the 3x4x2. By by and then we'll drop that right there. Okay. Okay. I know it makes it really wide with the ramp, so that's okay. We're going to hook up the signal to the ramp and the doors. Okay, next thing is, is we get these put in. Now, I think we're just going to go with the flat ones. So those are one... Those are one. That looks more industrial. Same with that. That's four blocks, though. That's a lot. That's too. It's too long. Yeah, we'll just do the old faithful, my good old faithful. So we'll get it wet, like just about far corner. We'll leave one one block in on each, like that. That's going to be four along there. That should be sufficient. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Okay, so that starts tapering right there. We want to move in right there. And then, whoa, freaking camera. And then we want to put that one right there. Okay. And then that one is going to be, we'll do it, same thing, one back and one in. Give myself a headache as we walk down there. And then get that in right there. Okay. Landing gear in. Cockpit in. Ramps in. I mean, we just got to do some minor stuff. The, uh, the lights. Uh, do the signals. Other than that, she's pretty much ready to rock and roll. So let's sit in the cockpit. And that will settle it down. There we go. Now we'll jump out. Um, here, let's... Auto group everything right now. Oh, I'm gonna have to auto group it again after because the uh, I, I haven't put the lights in. So we got to put lights in and the sentry guns. So I want to put a light. I want to put a light right here. And then that'll light up most of this area. Um, so I also actually, you know what, I'll do, I'll do one right here too. Okay. And then we need, where else should we do some lights? Do some lighting right up here. And then we need some lighting over by the constructor to, to either side of the doors. Can we do that? No. But we can put one right. Okay, how high is that? 
third down. Put one there. Should have just put the corner lights in here then instead. Oh well. That's okay. These will these will work just fine. So now we want this right there. One there. Okay, that should give us a ton. Oh wait, let's do one more. Do it right here. There we go. That should give us a ton of lighting. I don't think I'll need to put another one on the ceiling. Okay. Um, well, let's fire it up and we'll see what it looks like. See what it flies like. So let's grab fuel. So let's put that, so that's in blocks. Let's move blocks over to here. We're going to go CV, fuel, and we'll just throw it all in. It's not much. And then is there any other fuel? I'm going to have to make a bunch, aren't I? Yeah, I'm going to have to make a ton. So right here. Uh -huh. Okay, it gets us almost halfway. Okay, so let's fire it up. No, it was fired up as soon as I put fuel in. Okay. Uh, well, idling at half fuel with everything turned on. Uh, docked is 461. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, so let's let's launch ooh that goes up quite fast um hmm a little sluggish on the rcs though we don't have any weight in this thing yet okay so we're going to want to put those two those t2 rcs in okay so we Get up to height like right away. Get up to speed instantly. Forward. Side is really good. Yeah, we're not going to have to change anything with the sides. Okay, so we. Yeah, I'll, I'll change it so that those ramps come in. Don't worry. It's not our wings. <laughs> okay. Actually. Other than the RCS being a little sluggish, this thing, this thing actually has got some good speed to it. So it's definitely overthrusted for, for the weight that it's got right now, which is good. That's exactly what we want. So yeah, it stops pretty quick. Not bad. Okay, I like it. I like it. I like how the thrusters look from the back, too. I like those back thrusters. So we got a bunch of painting and texturing to do and make this thing look better, obviously. Okay, so let's level off. We'll just zoom out. And, oh, uh, yeah, of course it's, it's cloudy, so we can't see squat. Like, bloody hell. Okay, well, we'll just park and call it an episode because, you know, the weather is just horrible on this planet. Horrible. Okay, I would say that was success. And why does it show that there's no block there? That's, oh, no, there it is. Just the door wasn't showing correctly. Okay, so let's spin this a bit here. Walk it over. Because it's a side load. Doesn't really matter about front and back being too close. I just want to be able to get up into it. 
So let's twist a little bit. Nope, wrong way. We're going to twist a little bit there. Then we can pull forward. We got to put the uh, spotlights on too. Okay, we should be able to get the uh, HV in there now. There we go. Okay, so we'll put a couple of RCSs in. We'll get the, um, we'll figure out the paint scheme. So next episode, we're going to get this thing painted up. We're going to get all the signal logic done. Um, and get it all prepped for space, basically. We'll get it all, all the plants planted and the garden set. Um, get everything set up in it. We'll get the, the cargo boxes named. And uh, yeah, then we'll be ready to go for space. So until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.